Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel, your go-to place for tech and software tutorials that make your life easier. In today's video, we are diving into the world of modern recruiting with Loxo, the all-in-one ATS and CRM platform designed to streamline how you source, manage, and hire top talent. Whether you're a recruiter, talent acquisition specialist, or just getting started in the hiring game, this video will walk you through everything you need to know to hit the ground running with Aloxo. So let's begin by going to the official website, wherein you have three options on the top right corner. You can log in using your credentials, book a demo if you wanted, but the best option is to click the center blue button that says start free what will happen is you will be forwarded to a new page to make the account creation easier you can choose to continue signing up with your google account microsoft or you can even use your personal or work email if you do all i have to do right now is you will be forwarded to a new page wherein this is the perfect opportunity for us to explore the loxo platform okay so on the left side panel, you have all these sections that we can explore, okay? We have the jobs, people, companies, schedule, tasks, deals, outreach, and reports. On the top, is going to be at the overview, source, candidates, and reports. We're going to go to the section for the jobs because this is where... We open all closed or archive job requisitions are managed. Okay, so you have like owners, job insights, days to fill. You have the overview for that, the source of the jobs and the candidates, right? For example, we have um, a certain candidate here that which is Shannon Smith, entrepreneur from South Jordan, Utah. And then if you click on it, you will be forwarded to this section. You have all the profile, of course, the resume and activity. You can add a task for this specific uh, profile if you want. All right. You can also put in the scorecards or the intake, which is dependent on your goal. For example, I'm going to put in something. Now, I'm going to click on the save button. All right, so that's going to be one task for a specific candidate, which is going to be for Shannon Smith. I'm going to close this, and we're going to go to the people. The people is the talent database, all right? Contains hundreds of profiles or candidates or prospects and contacts. Now, in this section, there's going to be a plus button here on the top right corner. You can add, okay, candidates here. You can put in the keyword or boolean. You have that from the source, time zone, industry, years of experience. Okay. On the drop down menu, you can add a person, upload resume, or import CSV depending on your preference. We're going to add a specific person. Okay. Now, you can add the socials. Like, is it going to be a candidate? contractor or a contact so all i have to do you can edit this person later if you want to give it a more um interactive profile of course we're gonna put in a logo here and then so we have created our first contact here in luxo okay so we're gonna skip this now the companies are the CRM style view of all the organizations you work with. Right now, we have an organization for using Luxo, Entrepreneur. Now, you can add company profiles and associate them with jobs and contacts. So, we're going to create a new company, for example, this one, and click on Create. Of course, you can put in the website. And the link in if you have that you can also click the show advanced so you can put in the contact information such as 
email and phone number. But for now, we're going to click on the confirm button. You will be forwarded to a new page. Now you can pin this contact on top of the list from the people. On the top right, you have like a yellow button. You can put in the in progress, active opportunity, current client, the uh, current status. Right now, we're going to put in the current progress. The plus button if you want to add a new task, new deal, or new activity, depending, of course, on your goal. For now, we're going to skip this and we're going to the schedule. The schedule is your integrated calendar and scheduling tool. All right. Now, you can view upcoming interviews right here if you have if you haven't done that. So you can schedule interviews or follow up directly from the candidate. And of course, you need to choose the interview time. Is it going to be interviewing? Let's say May 30th and click on the yes send. Okay, you can also link a job, which is um, ideal because from here you can set in the entrepreneur and a lot more. Now, the task is simply what we have created earlier. These are short reminders or follow ups for interviews, calls, or outreach. Again, if you want to add a new task, just click this plus button. You can assign tasks to yourself. For example, this one right here. Or two team members if you're working in a collaborative environment. You can view tasks by due date or link contact jam. And then there's going to be the deals. The deals is where you manage business development or recruiting pipeline. Okay. You can add a new deal here. For example, this amount is you can choose the organization, point of contact, create the deal. You can track revenue potential from clients or placements, forecast and manage your business funnel. The outreach is an automated email and communication campaigns. So you can watch a video if you want here. All right. Let me do that right now. Or you can simply create your first campaign. Now you can create a new campaign from a predefined template. For example, we're going to browse some templates here. You have like candidate outreach for job opening, maybe at this first option. We're going to use that. And you have all the seven stages, zero prospects, open rate, click rate, and reply rate. So you have all this automation for you. Okay, so you can personalize messages at scale. You can build email sequence and drip campaigns to engage candidates or clients. You can track opens, clicks, and replies. And all I have to do is click the stage plus button. Okay, now the last is going to be the reports. So you can have analytics and performance tracking. You can monitor KPIs, productivity, placement rate, and source effectiveness, which is, as you can see, there's going to be a drop down here if you want to view legacy reports. So you can update your client or your team members. You have all these workflow or workflow pipeline until leaderboard. You see that there's going to be a share board option here. If you do, you will be forwarded here. You can set the permission access from everyone into private only with people with access. For example, you don't want other team members or freelancers to show this report. You want to just your client. You can do that as well. It's kind of easy. And with that being said, and that wraps up our walkthrough of Luxo, your all-in-one ATS and CRM solution for smarter recruiting. So Luxo is a solid choice for agencies and talent teams looking for a powerful, unified platform to source, track, and engage candidates more efficiently. So if you're serious about scaling your recruiting process, it's definitely worth trying. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel for more software tutorials and drop a comment. We'd love to hear from you. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next video.